What's going on, Elonians? Everybody interested in Doge Elon Mars, thank you so much for stopping by the Joe Lee channel. Known for my next dimension, out of the box, technical analysis, chart analysis, price prediction, and forecasting. And without further ado, let's go ahead and hop into today's forecast update. Elon is currently trending at 92700. As I record in Seoul, Korea, it is May 5th. Let's see how the pathways from the last video, intergalactic gains on Doge Day or 4 20 and yeah we did awesome guys this is actually kind of giving me some chills seeing these nice giant green light super candle gains from my prediction and it actually beat the timeline of my pathways so there's definitely gems in these pathways i'm not randomly just drawing these pathways there's a lot of confluence research and thought that goes into these pathways i want you guys to really pay attention and re-watch these videos to choose the pathway that most resonates with you and matches your game plan also stay tuned to the end of the video i will have a hybrid scenario i think it'll be worthwhile to check out not only very plausible but it could be a definitely amazing chance if you really really believe in doge elon in the long term so let's hop into today's scenarios as always and before we do that let me clean up the chart so we can start fresh with some new and improved pathways let's start with the first scenario which is the bullish scenario in this bullish scenario pathway what can happen is we continue upward moving into mid-May, end of May, June, and if momentum and rhythm of the market is really nice, we can go into July, possibly. So we'll penetrate resistance around 97928, lining up with my celestial web line right here as well. The sighting zone right there, it might tighten up. Finally penetrating, getting up to these last highs we got in April, also March, getting up to 118841 and 124567, around there, 128731. So we'll get up there, bring it to May or June. Finally, if we do get enough juice going into July, it's possible that we can definitely work our way up to last resistance zones we got in like last year of December, 143551, and also possibly all the way up to this last major swing high we got in January, 168. 472184379. Something like that. It could be here before pulling back or getting up to here. We're going to focus on short to midterm guys and try to be realistic and reasonable as possible. Maybe later we'll go into long term targets. Another pathway of this bullish scenario that can happen, I am seeing that we are getting a possible corrective wave pattern on the short to midterm. If anybody's into Elliott wave theory, we're completing a possible fifth wave where it's one two two doesn't retrace the zero we got three right here and then we got four possibly in the works and what happens is this fifth wave could come back down going into in may of this last week we got here of eight six one two five creating a double bottom it's kind of support as well with these wicks right here in april march so it is possible in this pathway we could you know come back down going into mid-may before reversing same case as i showed you in the last pathway getting up to nine seven six seven two and then 118494, something like this. And then possibly get up to 142786 before retracing. And then also, if we do really good going into June and July, maybe even getting up to 178010, okay? And then retracing. So definitely stay tuned to see how the pathways are unraveling. Another pathway of the bullish scenario is that this fifth wave of this corrective wave pattern, it could go a lot deeper, where it could go all the way to this last bottom right here in this region. It could be anywhere from 79596 to 7438, so even down to my celestial web line acting as heavy, heavy support at 7211. Let me draw that out going into mid to end of May to June, and then we'll reverse from there so it could do something like this something like this working its way back up and then just the same situation there or like i was saying it could go further as well we're going into mid to end of may or in the next week or two get down to the celestial web line at 72280 okay before finding kinetic energy to rip to the upside getting through the celestial web line same thing so very similar getting through heavy resistance here around 96919 and then yeah same case from there if you're not familiar with my celestial web line they're based off a very peculiar and divine symmetry tested off of thousands and thousands of hours and sleepless nights they're great for understanding how the market is moving 
moving, the momentum and the rhythm of the market. Just like a spider's web, when somebody or something touches it, the spider can use its sense of vibration to understand what it's dealing with before making very precise movement. They're great for understanding the future, present, and past, not just random dash lines or your ordinary trend lines that you find in conventional technical analysis. So let me quickly give you a variant of the bullish scenario. Yes, we can rally starting from these two candles that have been printing right here. But what happens is it doesn't go as high as we want it. And going into mid to end of May, we make a slightly higher low, getting up to these uh, wicks we got in April of 118669. This one too, around there, 125315 and 128668, something like that. Before we make our way back down, a lot of people will be expecting a lot, but in the end, going into summer, June, July, it reverses back to the downside. We'll see how this plays out. Definitely stay in tune with the channel. This could be still a great trade opportunity, still 30%, something like that, give or take. If you're into that, that could be also an idea uh, for your game plan. This is not financial advice, just for educational and entertainment purposes. So so let me give you the bearish scenario, the second scenario. I know you guys don't like it, but I have to give it because we never know what can happen. There could be a big crash or a capitulation event. We need to be ready for it. Using the pathways from the bullish scenario is we can pull back down to 0 0.0072325 and then you know get a bounce later, something like that, and where it comes back down here and then does something like this. Of course, we're gonna get a rally or a dead cat bounce, but what happens, it just goes nowhere near as high as we want it. That could fool a lot of people where it could get up to, let's say this is gonna be acting as heavy resistance, even though it was support, for example, if it breaks back down here around nine, two, five, seven, six, and from there, it just gets kind of stuck, and then we fall back down, something like this. Okay, that's one pathway for the bearish scenario. Another pathway as well, using that variant of the bullish scenario is yes, we can bounce up to around 117361. So let me draw another one going into the end of May or even beginning of June. To continue from there, as we come back down, going into summer, June, July, August, not only do we come back down, it just keeps making lower highs and lower lows. And it comes back down. We'll use my celestial web line acting as heavy support support as the main target for now and then there's going to be bounces and rallies in between stay in touch i'll be sharing that on the channel something like this which leads me into a hybrid scenario and thank you so much if you made it this far into the video this could be a very amazing opportunity if you're a big believer in doji elon mars if you believe in this project the team the utility what it represents and you're able to hold on for how many years to stomach the pain anguish and anxiety and also you know do you have the funds and using this pathway right here it could actually even go lower than this guys right now it's at 79 zero six eight come back down right here let's say we get a capitulation event we'll use this last wick all the way in january all the way back down that low five oh five eight four possible once in a lifetime chance there's no guarantees of course it's something to keep in mind if in theory everything works out going into how many years before we finally get a reversal it's going to depend 2023 to 2024 this could take how many years choose a pathway that most resonates with you that matches your game plan regardless if we're in a bull or bear market i'm going to update no matter what i'm in it for the long run there's going to be something for everybody on the channel regardless if you're a trader or an investor there's going to be all types of ideas and pathways that have gems in them to take advantage of and to hopefully stay on the right side which is the upside everything's going to be free on the channel don't have a patron or a membership not yet at least hang in there guys i know it can be frustrating may the gains be with you so see you in the next forecast update thank you so much and peace